Welcome to the .NET Way. You're watching episode 3 of our C Sharp interview series where we walk through real world questions and answers to help you prepare for interviews with confidence. If you missed our earlier episodes, we've already covered C Sharp basics, data types, variables and operators. Be sure to check those out. Today, we'll dive into control statements, loops, and decision-making in C-sharp, topics that are commonly asked in interviews at all levels. Let's welcome back our candidates, Sanya, and begin. Sanya, can you explain what control statements are in C-sharp? Sure. Control statements help you manage the flow of execution in a program. They include decision-making statements like if, else, switch, and looping constructs like for, while, and do while. How does the if-else statement work in c -sharp? The if-else statement checks a condition. If the condition is true, one block of code runs. If it's false, the else block runs. It's used to make decisions based on runtime data. What's the difference between if, else, and switch statements. If, else works well for complex conditions or ranges. Switch is better when checking one variable against multiple constant values. It also looks cleaner when there are many conditions. Can you name the types of loops available in c -sharp? Yes. c -sharp has three main types of loops. For, while, and do while. Each loop repeats a block of code based on a condition. When should we use a for loop? For loops are ideal when the number of iterations is known ahead of time, like iterating through a fixed array or list. What's the difference between while and do while? In a while loop, the condition is checked before the loop body runs. In a do while loop, the body runs at least once and then the condition is checked. Can you explain the use of break and continue? Yes. Break is used to exit the loop early. Continue skips the current iteration and jumps to the next one. Both improve control inside loops. What is a nested loop? A nested loop means a loop inside another loop. They are used in scenarios like printing patterns or processing multidimensional arrays. What is the ternary operator in c -sharp? It's a shortcut for an if-else statement. It's written as condition, question mark, value if true, colon, value if false. For example, string result equals age greater than 18 question mark, adult, colon, minor. What are some common mistakes developers make in loops or conditions. Some common mistakes include infinite loops, missing break statements in switch, off by one errors in for loops, and using equals instead of equals 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 in conditions. Great answers as always, Sanya. That wraps up episode 3 of the C-Sharp interview series. We hope this helped clarify how control statements and loops work in C-Sharp. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the .NET Way. In episode 4, we'll be covering object-oriented programming in C Sharp, a major interview topic. Thanks for watching and happy coding!